I don't like this music. What is happening right now? Oh no, fire! Fire, run guys, run! No, there's a fire! Is this a cliff? Oh, that's a cliff! This way, this way guys, this way! This way, it's a, it's a forest fire! Come on, this way! Oh, jump up, jump up! Jump up! I can't, I can't get up, I can't do it. I can't, oh, guys, jump. Jump for your life, jump for your life. Jump for your, okay, I'm, I'm a loser. I can't jump. Okay, just run around, just run around it, just run around it. Can we get out this way? Can we go up here? Do we have to go up? All right, wait, hold on. Let's go up here. Let's go up on here, on, on this cliff. I don't know where to go. We can just walk up on this cliff right here. Is this gonna keep us safe from the fire? Did the fire just go out? I still see smoke. Luna, no. In autumn, when the hills are yellow and red, the cubs are called to follow the path of solitude. Oh man. You guys are gonna leave me now. Just get it over with. Kiss me goodbye at least. Guys? Guys? I'm gonna try to stay with you, yeah? What did you kill? Dude, what did you kill? Oh, just a nest. Hey, I'm gonna I'm gonna be like one of those moms that's just like, hey, wanna hang out? Let's hang out. I wanna hang out with you. I don't care about solitude. Let's go to the movies. Let's go to the mall. I, I want to be best friends forever. You guys can't do this to me. Let's, 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 no, no, no. I see what you're doing and I don't like it. We're going to stick, we're going to stick together as a family, okay? Ohana. Don't play me this way, Mowgli. Stick together, guys. Until the game forces us apart. This is interesting because I'm basically following them at this point versus them following me. Like if I broke off from them, they definitely would go their own way. Which is just an interesting game dynamic because, you know, they've been following me for so long. Hey! Stop trying to get away from me! I birthed you! I raised you! I saved you guys! Peachy and Fleur died. So stay with me. I still I still call a little bit of a of a jip on that Fleur death because I had that fox carcass. Mowgli. Don't split off now. No, don't do this. We stick together. Family style. Duck. Can we cross this river? I don't even know. Look, you guys, I can still feed you just like old times. Oh, Luna, seriously? Do you like swimming? Is that Luna? No, Luna, what are you doing? Luna. I feel like that's a very bad decision. We all just died. We all just died. We all just drowned. Are you kidding me? I'm, how do I swim? How do I swim? I, I just shook off. Oh, here you guys are. Okay, Luna, listen, I need to lead because that was just, that was just silly. That was just really, really silly of you. So, if we could just stick together a little bit, that would be great. I feel like we're back in the forest where the bears are. And I really don't want to take on a bear alone without... Without my cubs, is what I was just about to say. Thank you. And Mowgli? Mowgli? Mowgli, no! Mowgli, why? Oh, hey, why am I so out of breath? And where did your brother go? Oh, they're over this way. I think I'm getting old. I can't... I think I am getting old. I can't shift anymore. I can't sprint at all. Please don't let a bear come now.
Are you guys ditching me? I don't want to be ditched, but I can't sprint anymore. All right, come give me a kiss, Mowgli. Give me a kiss. You too, Luna. I love you guys. We're a family. Goodbye. I gotta let them go do their own thing. It's what the game wants. There Luna goes. Mowgli went somewhere over there. Yep, I can't even sprint anymore. So I think I've done my mama job. Raise them up good. It's the best you can do. I've been healed! This is great news. Look at this beautiful area. Ooh, you know what? I should try eating myself. Eat. You haven't eaten in like about six months. So that probably tastes good. There's deer over there. I so want to find a bear. Okay, I have yet to find a bear, and I'm pretty sure the game wants me to go back to the big tree where I gave birth. Uh, that's where it sort of will probably do the same ending as uh, the first installment of Shelter 2. I don't really want to do that, though. I just want to kind of... Wait a minute. What? Why is it starting to snow? We're experiencing another season? Am I going to die? I've been eating. I've been eating pretty well. Oh, uh, that's this might not be good. I'm not even sure if this is the way I should be coming. Okay, we're seeing the northern lights again, and I'm actually walking on the ice. This is over by where I killed the fox and then went back for Fleur. I had wanted to explore over here, so maybe it's a good thing that I found myself back here. Look how beautiful the ice is, and see how it, I kick it up in my feet? Oh, this game. Are you kidding me? <gasps> this is beautiful. Oh, this game. I love it. Is this my dead fox still? Are you serious? I mean, I guess I did leave him on ice. Are you kidding me? It's still here. My dead fox. Can I eat you? Oh, my gosh. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, just rub it in. Just lick yourself. Oh, my gosh. Well, glad I uh, kept that snack. Look at look at my design. That's so cool. Lila, you're so pretty. Let's go towards the Northern Lights. We never came up this way because this is where we got the cutscene that said to go back to uh, that the cubs were growing up and then we lost Fleur. So this is really cool. Oh, it's so pretty over here. I'm really glad I decided to come this way, even though my cubs are basically on their own now. This is really cool to see. Let me sniff. Okay. Let's keep coming. I want to see how close I can get to these northern lights. Look how cool they are. Should we go to the left or should we keep going straight? The left is kind of the winter area that we might have went to in the previous shelter game. Let's come this way and see what's around here. Look at the reflection too, that detail. You can almost see the northern lights at times, like it's really reflecting the terrain above me. Look at that. That's so pretty. Ooh, this is where the ice stops. Ooh, okay, let's not go that way then. No, indeed. Let me take a look at the map, actually, and see where are we? Oh, we're way up there. Okay, I think we've covered a lot of ground. Okay, this is all a time lapse. I am sitting on the bank of this river. Somehow I got to the other side of it, and I need to get back across it. 
and I can't. I can't figure out from the map how to do it. I know I've done it in the past, but I can't figure it out. So I'm waiting for it to freeze uh, because I think that's the only thing I can do. I had looked up and I had seen that the bears actually in the winter season uh, become white. So they look like polar bears instead of grizzly bears. And so I really tried uh, during the snowy part of the game to just look for a bear, but I don't think that they spawn in anymore unless you have cubs with you. Uh, either that or I just couldn't find one. Something else to mention is that one time when I was looking at the map, uh, when I came back to the game, it had switched my settings. I don't know if this is an intentional thing that you can do or if it's a glitch, but I am now facing forward, so I have to like walk backwards. <laughs> I'm trying to hasten, but you've got to freeze this river because I have gone up and down and up and down looking for a way to cross and I am convinced by looking at the map that the only way to cross it is when the river is in fact frozen. So if you would be so kind as to just turn winter so that the river can freeze I would gladly hasten to my den. And I'm still mad that I didn't see a polar bear. Yes! Finally! Finally, 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 finally! Freeze! Freeze, you stupid river! I just want to hasten to my den. That's all I ever wanted to do. Is it frozen yet? <gasps> it's frozen! It's frozen! <laughs> Yay! Goodbye, mountains! It was nice. Wait, what? Nope, nope, not that way. There we go. We're heading back to Big Tree. Finally, we have hastened to my den. Now, the real question is, what's going to happen now? Is it going to be a similar ending to the first Shelter 2 without the expansion for mountains? Or is it going to be different? Where's my tree? So there's my tree. And yep, we're still in this perspective. So let's just go ahead and run home and see what happens when we get there who knows i did not mean to kill that bunny but who knows maybe maybe luna and mowgli uh will be there waiting for me and uh it'll be a happy ending perhaps all right i can see the big tree let's drop the dead weight literally and and now we can hasten there oh this series has been so much fun. I love the graphics of this game so, so much. Can I just get there? Paige, Molly, and Polly need to be on, uh, they need to be on a walk. They have made it clear that they would like to go on a walk. Ah, big tree. Here we go. Let's go. Let's go. All right. I have found my den. Uh, wait. Where? Oh, here it is. Here it is. Oh, I'm back in the den. I've made it. What's going to happen? <gasps> What's going to happen? I don't have any cubs. I went to bed. Now see, there is some, this happened in the last, uh, the last playthrough of Shelter, and I personally feel as though I just died. And now I am in the afterlife, the Lynx afterlife, and I am going to be guided by the stars uh, to go home. Now, there were some people that thought that I'm about to meet my mate, 
This is super hard to do, by the way, in uh, this perspective. But, oh, I love this part. But there were some people that thought, yeah, I'm going to meet a new mate. But if that was the case, I think that you would be able to continue to play as yourself and have cubs. I've gone the wrong... I've kind of gone the wrong way. Um, I think the fact that you now, after this, uh, play as a new lynx, one of your cubs, means that you have returned to the earth and, you know, circle of life and all of that. Uh, you can choose to believe whatever you want. Maybe I am meeting a new mate. Uh, maybe I'll ask the game makers uh, sometime if I ever meet them. That's just my interpretation of it, is that I just, when you saw me sleeping in the den, uh, the place where my cubs' lives began, my life ended. That's, I know it's sad, but, you know, that's, that's what I love about this game, is that it really does speak to the harsh realities of nature. Sometimes nature is brutal and it's sad, uh, but that is, that's just life with these animals. I'm completely stuck. This is, this is not good. This is not good. Where's the star? Ah, right there. Turn around again. Come this way. <gasps> All right. And there we go. Oh, now see, that looks like a predator. But I don't think it is. I don't like this music. What's happening now? I can't run. But see, I'm coming onto this beautiful field. That's just... That's why I feel this way about this game, but I would love to know what your interpretation of the ending is, so please leave it in the comments. Why am I, like, stalking right now? No, but see, now the music changes. <gasps> Hello! And see, I think that this is Luna, fully grown, because it's a white one, and I believe in the last time, it wasn't, so I think that this is Luna in her prime, walking her mom into the afterlife. That's just what I think, and I think it's so beautiful. You can believe whatever you want, but that's going to be my interpretation of this game that I love so, so much. It means a lot to me, so thank you for watching this Let's Play, and I'll let the credits roll to give thanks to the makers of the game. Paige and Molly love you. Go rescue a dog.